should go upstairs? Closet tour time. Closet tour. We spent three and a half hours at the container store. So excited to share the after of our clothing closet. Hey you guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Brittany Xavier and this is my husband Anthony. You may have noticed we took a two week break to regroup and just really get refreshed. It's so important for mental health to just take that break when you really need it. We needed it after the baby and just being really low on sleep. So we're back refreshed and feeling, well, we're still tired. Hopefully but. we look refreshed. <laughs> we're still <laughs> we're tired. tired. But we are really, really excited because our closets have been redone. When we first bought our house in the last year and moved moved into the space, the closets were probably our biggest complaint because they had these built-in shelves that were really cumbersome and they just weren't a good use of the space, especially for how we like to maximize as much storage as we can. I have a lot of clothes, Jaden has a lot of shoes. And I have very little, so. <laughs> Anthony has barely anything. I get my little section of the closet. <laughs> <laughs> but we like to be really efficient with how we store our items, and I wanted to make sure everything was really easy to see. So when we're getting ready in the morning, we have everything right in front of us, and we're not going downstairs to the garage, going to the other clothing rack. Everything was really spread out before. So that's why we're very excited to be a partnering with Container Store. So Container Store, when you get in there, like you have so many creative ideas because I mean, oh gosh, the possibilities are endless. And what they also offer is a custom closet system. And we knew about this when we were living in our apartment and mm -hmm. really trying to maximize space, noticing that we had a lot of wall space, but a lot of things on the floor and very small closets. We actually purchased one of their Alpha system and that changed our lives completely. So when we are talking about our house remodel one of the things that we said was really important was having closets done by the container store because we had already used them we were used to how the system was and it really worked for our lifestyle so when it came time to redo the closets we had a call with the container store and they did a custom consultation they asked us what our needs were for the closet, what type of coloring we were looking for, how many shoes we had, what's the biggest problems that we were having with our current closet system and what we were looking to improve upon. We decided that the Avera system was the best for our needs and it looked really nice with the rest of our house and the aesthetic we had with the remodel. My biggest thing was all my accessories are always scattered in the closet that I had before I was able to put everything together. So now in living in our house, I felt like my bags were in one area. I was using different closets throughout the house because I have so many items. So what I wanted to do is have one wall that had all handbags, shoes, and jewelry. And I didn't know if that was possible because it seemed like a lot was gonna have to fit into a space. Talking to the container store, they said that's absolutely possible and they gave me a layout that I really, really loved. Jaden's biggest concern was her shoe organization. She has a lot of sneakers and she has a lot, lot of, of a lot of clothes, a lot of hanging clothes for school. Her room is not redone yet, but the with her remodel, she's gonna have a lot of storage space underneath her bed. So the biggest thing was she didn't want drawers in her closet. She wanted hanging and shoes. Shoes. A shoe wall. Ish. <laughs> so that was the main concern with hers. With Poppy's room, we needed space for small hanging clothes, and I also wanted a mini shoe wall because she has a lot of sneakers and a lot of little shoes we wanted to display. So those Naturally. were our biggest asks and Container Store was very excited and happy and they said that these are completely possible. They just had to get creative with the layout because of how our doors opened up in our closet. So they sent someone out and we had completely demoed the closets because we wanted them to be able to get a clear picture on how much space they can utilize. So they were able to take their measurements, go back to their offices and send us a mock-up of basically they took our needs of what we wanted. They came out again and had an install day and set everything up, which I was so surprised how quick that was. After install day, we were really excited to put all of our pieces back in, but after browsing online on the container store, I realized they had different dividers that you could put into the drawers to keep everything really, really organized. And putting in all my items into a brand new closet, I wanted it to be as clean and organized as possible. I wanna really keep a system that will stay that way. And so we decided to go in store to the container store because I, I just love shopping there in general, but you, you get really in inspired there. there because you see different things you can add in to just make your life easier. We spent three and a half hours at the container store. That was so much fun though. It's like almost when you get there, you don't know time has gone by. It's just like you I get realized, sucked into the creativeness. I realize my whole house needs to be reorganized. Actually our kitchen, the home edit helped us a ton with the kitchen and I think that's why I was getting overwhelmed because I walked in there and we had in mind 
that we needed to get items for the closet so we can finish putting everything away. So we got these really cool dividers and just so many different things that we can use for the drawer organization. Got these drawer dividers. So we spent a lot of time in the bedroom really thinking about what we needed to make everything organized. But then I went to the section with all the clear containers. Just Your mind starts to wander <laughs> and you're like, wait, this can be used for the bathroom or this can be used for the linen closet or, and then, it was really fun. When I saw the clear containers, it reminded me that we can be doing this for different areas in our, I wanna redo my fridge. I have items for our bathroom because that just got remodeled and we haven't put any of the serums or any of my face products back in there. We have a lot of stuff in boxes, in the garage, and now we just need a place to put them. They have all these, I think Container Store is my new favorite store because it's almost like a bunch of different fun stores in one. It's stuff you haven't thought about, but, but then you when need. you get there and you're like, oh, this would make my life so much easier. I got this s'more maker. I love <laughs> s'mores and we don't have a fire pit. So I thought this was a necessity. <laughs> I'm literally gonna have one tonight. Just add it on to the car. I also got some, cause I'm going to do meal prepping. So I found that they had a lot of cool containers for lunches, just reorganizing my fridge, which I'm really excited about that. And they had a lot of cool, I think we got a lot of kitchen stuff too. Like, yeah. And then I got these for Poppy. They're little reusable snack baggies for when she starts to eat finger foods with in just a few months. It says six months and up, but they're silicone, no P BPA. I was going crazy and I was like, this is so Basically, much fun. Basically we went in to just get stuff to organize our new closets, but then- What is this? We what? just hit every area in our house where it's like kitchen or dining room or- Poppy's meal prep. Poppy stuff. <laughs> We are really, really inspired because we have so many pieces now to put the closets back together is gonna to be really fun. Yeah. So now after all the meetings, the install day, shopping for the organization, we put our clothes and all of our accessories back in and we're excited to share with you guys the final result. Should we go upstairs? Closet tour time. Closet tour. So excited to share the after of our clothing closet. Are you ready? It looks so much different than the before. Ta-da! So many more clothes that fit into this space, which I was shocked by how small this closet felt before. And just by having a system that was so custom made so many more clothes fit without having to add more square footage. All my clothes are on this side. Shirts are on the bottom. So it goes tank tops in order of into dresses. And then I have all my jackets that are more lightweight jackets and sweatshirts up here. We have a jacket closet downstairs that's more for like bigger coats if we're going out. And all my pants. I love the display of this. I'm not one to like to fold my clothes. I like everything hanging. The drawers have all of our pajamas, activewear, underwear, socks. So this is more, say more lounging around the house pieces and outfits are all hung. Anthony's side is over here, a lot of shirts, pants. On the top, we have more seasonal items. These we're gonna add labels to. These are also all from Container Store. And I have my desk covers for all my handbags, swimsuits, shorts. I have things that are more, I don't wear all the time, but I wanna be able to access them easily if I need to. Anthony has a few of his camera bags in there and his belts. Some accessories, again, he's not using all the time, but when we're traveling, we wanna be able to grab all of our pieces all at once in this closet area. This makes it feel so luxurious in here. And look at the dimming option. Definitely an upgrade. <laughs> Definitely an upgrade. Are you ready for my handbag, shoe, and jewelry wall? One of my favorite things about my room now is how everything is in one area. For the shoes, these are all the shoes I wear most often. I have my really, really tall boots downstairs in a more seasonal area in our garage that I had lined up, but I don't want my closet to be everything ever that I ever need. So more seasonal, I'm gonna be swapping out. For me, it's easier to go with color coordination versus the type of shoe, because when I'm getting ready in the morning, I think I need a black shoe. I wanna just look at my black shoes. I don't wanna say, where's the black sandals, black heels? For me, it's easier that I just look at all the black shoes and I make a decision very quickly. Same thing with my handbags. It's really nice to have everything color coordinated so when I'm choosing a piece, it's easy for me to see everything. And I cannot tell you how much this has made getting ready in the morning so nice for me because I just sit here and I'm inspired because I can see everything. Now for my jewelry. 
The fact that these are concealed, they're really easy to see. We got all these organization pieces at this container store too, and they fit really well in the Avera drawers. I have all my designer jewelry here, the ones I wear every day in the middle, and my enamel fun pieces. This next drawer, I have my personalization for Jaden and Poppy. I'm very into personalized name necklaces for them. So I have three drawers of jewelry. I also have a drawer of my gold necklaces. And I have one drawer of sunglasses. And this is a nice way to display them because fabric is really soft, so they're not gonna get scratched. And I'm able to put some of these face down because the material is so soft. Let's go into Jaden's room and check out her organization. I would have had Jaden explain her closet, but she's at school and I didn't think this through before. All her clothes are all in one area. She has a dresser over here that has her pajamas, active wear, but this is all her outfits and then she has all her school uniforms over here. These are from the container store too. They're for jewelry and I thought it was perfect with the aesthetic in here and very nice for organization. Jaden also likes to hang her denim. She has a sneaker obsession. Really have tried to fit in everything that she has here with all her sneakers. The big thing with her, she likes to keep a lot of the boxes. So these are her favorite boxes right now, but she likes to have them in a way that they're displayed. We have some also at the top too, but these are her favorites and she wants to circle them out. And the handbags that she uses the most right now are here. With Jaden's closet, I originally thought she would need something for a long hang. Maybe if she has a longer jacket or dresses, but she said because she doesn't have that many dresses and any of her longer coats she keeps in the coat closet, she didn't want a long hang. We put her shorter dresses up here and we have a few of the longer dresses here with her jeans but she that wasn't a priority for her and i feel like this works because it keeps everything really uniform hers is pretty straightforward for a teenager room and we wanted to make it really user friendly let's move into poppy's room very excited about poppy's nursery closet reveal we didn't show it during the room reveal video because we thought it'd be better to have this video part of all of our other closets check that video out above if you haven't seen it yet it shows what the rest of her room looks like I'm very excited because her little shoe wall came to life. Are you ready? So excited about this and her tiny, tiny little shoes. I had to display her little Versace and Tods because they're so small and cute, I can't even. This is where we have all of her nightgowns for nighttime. I have a few of my books I read for her and her books. We are really utilizing the space in her drawers. These pieces are also from Container Store. But I really wanted to have everything sectioned off and very easy to find everything and see what she has. She has a lot of shoes and then these are more of her kind of like dressier shoes but also this I have a lot of these sock sneakers. I really like that because we have more space with the organization of this closet I don't have to smash everything and I can have it out displayed nicely. This is all of her accessories and I have her hats, her beanies here more bows, these are more the stretchy ones, and then I have mittens. And then we have more blankets, just a lot of storage, I love it. All right, this is where we have all of Poppy's clothes. So here's all of her tops, and we have her dresses here, I have pants, and then I have coats and jackets here. Right now she's in zero to three months, so this is all zero to three months clothing. The three to six months I have folded in the drawers below, so what's gonna happen is when she starts getting to that size, I'm gonna slowly start transferring out these pieces, but when I come into her closet, these are all items that currently fit her. And I also got some containers put up here too for more seasonal items, I'm gonna put them up here that way if we're going on a trip and I need something, maybe a bigger jacket or maybe if she has a swimsuit, then I can pull from there. So I'm gonna add those as well. We added in these containers for storing her blankets. I just love how it came out. And here are my diaper bags. I have my two Chanel and my Dior. I liked to keep the diaper bags in here versus in my closet because I tend to use them as a regular bag then. So I wanted to make sure that when I'm getting ready, when I'm packing her for going out for the day, that everything I need is all right here. And her Versace bear. I thought this was really cute. More for display because it's so adorable. Don't forget the links to everything we used are in the description box and also pinned in the top comment. And thank you again to the Container Store for making our closets exactly how we wanted them. And we'll see you guys next week.